In this video, we will talk about the relevance of media message and information literacy. Also, we expect to learn about the importance of becoming media literate at the end of this video. So first, what is media literacy? Media literacy means being able to think critically about evaluate more fully what's being presented. Media literacy asks who created the media message and why. It examines through the deconstruction how color, music, layout, motion, lighting, camera angles, and similar techniques affects a person's perception. A TV show, a web page, a news story, advertising, or a social media post are all examples of media that convey a message to an audience. So, how important evaluating media messages and information? Media literacy is important because it allows participants to understand the messages they are receiving. With so many sources of information available today, media literacy can assist individuals identifying reliable source and filtering through the confusion to seek the facts. What it is important to understand is that media literacy is not about protecting kids from unwanted messages. Although some groups urge families to just turn the TV off, the fact is media are ingrained in our cultural millennium that even if you turn off the seat, you still cannot escape to this media culture. Media no longer just influence our culture, they are our culture. Media literacy, therefore, is about helping students become competent, critical, and literate in all media forms so that they control the interpretation of what they see or hear rather than letting the interpretation control them. To become media literate, it is not to memorize facts or statistics about the media but rather to learn to raise the right questions about what you are watching, reading, or listening to. Learn to think critically. When we examine media, we consider if the message we receive makes sense, as well as why certain material was included, what was left out, and what was the main aim of the piece is. We learn to support our points of view through examples, then, based on what we already know, we can make our own decisions. De Media literacy as an educational tool. Media literacy can also be used to learn about new ideas, culture, and perspective that may not have been previously considered. Understanding media will help you to do better at school or work, or writing a persuasive essay. Media literacy can also help people decide what they want to learn more about the field and the gaps in knowledge the traditional media may have left out. For example, someone is spreading news on Facebook, not knowing if it is real or fake, could some considered lack of media information literate, and made up fake news sadly leads to misinformation of others, so it can affect wholesomely. That's why we need to be media information literate as well as for our self-growth. Moral lesson, it is not just important to evaluate messages and information, it's vital. It will determine whether children are used to it as a tool by the media or if the media is used by children. To engage in digital society, one must be able to use, interpret, question, create, communicate, and think critically about information and media. It is critical to be able to access, organize, analyze, evaluate, and create messages in a number of formats.